The use of motion simulation tools within SOLIDWORKS 3D CAD software helps students understand physics by giving them an interactive model that they can control. Students will learn how to simulate the launching of a projectile by a trebuchet. They will be able to see the path of the projectile as it flies toward the target. This gives students a visual understanding of Newton's laws using a medium they find both realistic and entertaining. SOLIDWORKS provides various graphing options to give students a full perspective. These include the kinetic and potential energy of the projectile. To gain further understanding of the relationship between the height of the projectile and its potential energy, students can watch a red line move across the graph as the simulation progresses. They're able to look at a specific moment in time to see how it matches up with the value of potential energy. Next, students will learn how to simulate the forces on a portion of the trebuchet by running a finite element analysis. Students will learn how to determine what restraints and forces need to be placed on the part in order to simulate its operation within the trebuchet assembly. After running the simulation, students can look at the results from various angles. One common value is the factor of safety. The values are graphed onto the part showing the locations of high stress and students can run an animation to see how the stresses develop. Finally, students will create an entire assembly from individual parts. To assemble the parts, students use constraints called mates. These mates are used to link or restrain any two given parts. For example, a mate is used to create a relationship between the inside surface of the weight and the metal dowel of the arm. This forces the inside surface to be concentric with the dowel. Students can see how the small part they analyzed fits into the assembly and how each component is important. 